Thank you everybody for coming today. So what I was gonna do is break up into two, two groups. So everybody can get more in-depth experience of what we do at the net, which is down there. Eels are pretty cool because they are migrating fish. Uh, most people, when they think migrating fish, they think the Atlantic salmon, um, but an eel has the opposite life cycle. It's born in the salt water and then migrates to estuaries, brackish and fresh water uh, to live the majority of his life before migrating back to the Atlantic Ocean. These nets are designed to catch these glass eels and allow us to count them locally and then sort of culminate this data and get an overall analysis of the population of these eels to see whether their population is increasing or decreasing locally. This is conducted of course in the spring season, early spring to late spring towards the summer. And this gives us an idea of how much we need to conserve this species. It lets us collect biological information on these eels, it lets us look at their migrational patterns and allows us to better understand the species as a whole, which contributes to the scientific community as well. We are releasing the eels. We're setting them above the dam to take the obstacle out of their way. Eels are important to our estuary ecosystem. They are both predator and prey, um, a great asset in the food chain. Predator towards smaller fish and things that live on the bottom. So they're, when I mean, they provide food, they are prey to larger fish like striped bass and, and larger fish we care about in our estuary. Um, they're also a species fascinating in and of themselves. Um, worth our attention. All right. All right, I gotta warm my toes up, so I'll be sitting in my warm car for a little bit. Don't drive away with cold toes. I can <laughs>